Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Solana and the best times are ahead of us. Before we begin, do not forget to join our monthly subscription, especially the third tier has only one spot left. It is the VIP everyday trading strategy and scalping. Thank you so much for watching. Let's go right now to see Solana against USDT chart. You can see in the four hour frame, what do we have with Solana is that it has gone insanely, insanely up, ignoring every single risk metric right here. You could think that, oh, here it's going down, here it's going down, here it is going down as well. But when is it going to go down? We are going to find out. First of all, the 1200 moving average has now been the past, okay? And we need the 20 day EMA, this yellow line right here on your screen, and the 50 day EMA, the red line, we need them to cross above the 200 moving average. So what we need to do it is simply we need to cross above while Solana being above the yellow and the red line. Okay, this should be the first bullish sign. The second one is to go into many time frames to see what Solana has been doing. So eventually the fact that we are above the 200 moving average in the six hour frame is good as well. But if you go to the nine hour frame, we are not bullish in the longer time frames yet. What I mean by that is we do not have a breakout in the longer time frames. In the daily frame, for example, we do not have a breakout yet. In the weekly scale, we started the weekly pretty, pretty good. And you can see this might be the start of something more impulsive for Solana. I definitely believe that, right? I definitely believe that this could be the case that Solana is more bullish right now. But anyway, I'm going to draw a Fibonacci this time from the top to the bottom right here. You can see that the first step is to close above the 12.26 in the weekly scale. If we can manage to do that, then Solana is going to probably go to the 15.90, followed by the 20 USDT. From where we are right now, this is a nice, let me just delete this one, start the price range. This is a nice plus 14% to 15, followed by another 42% profit target, right? Not something bad at all. And in a bearish cycle, we, we need that. But are we still in a bearish cycle? We will find out pretty soon enough inside the 2023. But in overall, Solana has been doing fantastic. We haven't made the significant breakout yet in the weekly scale. However, we are about to get there. Now, what to be careful about? In the four hour frame right now, okay, there is a slight chance that we are going to correct. I probably, for me personally, we are going to have a very healthy correction. Okay, I'm going to go all in down from this bottom to this top. Maybe Solana is going to go down towards the price range of around 12.47. If this happens, it isn't something that should be um, something very bearish, okay? We are seeing corrections every time when we have a nice uptrend, and especially when we expect in the weekly scale to go into an impulsive. This is why I'm covering Solana right now. I'm expecting Solana to go into an impulsive wave mode. But anyway, for the time being, Solana could be going to the 12.47, and from there, there is a very huge chance that we are going to go all the way up, okay? So this should be very, very good. This should be pretty, pretty awesome for Solana. Um, as of course, there is a slight chance that we are going to go all the way up higher, but we have the 50-day exponential moving average right now, followed by a very huge risk that I think that this is going to convert into a small healthy correction, right? I'm just looking at the RSI. Do not look at any other risk metric, okay? You can see stochastic RSI had a fake out to the downside. Okay, the Komodo Channel Index is sitting in an overbought a while ago, but we keep going higher. Only watch the RSI. And this thing right here is letting us know that we are about probably to have a small healthy correction coming in for Solana. Nothing though worrying for now. I've not seen any triple bearish or say divergence, for example, in this uptrend. I'm not seeing something that we should be concerned about. Okay, so do not worry about a small health correction. I'm telling you right now, this is the most likely scenario, 12.47. Even if we go there, I think that we are going to see 
an uptrend again for Sol and we are going to go even, even higher. You can see that Solana does not stop. So this is why it is important to just get in at the targets that we are giving in this channel. We talked about Solana, we should be having a buying entry around the 8 USDT to the 10 USDT and right there we saw into the next week a plus 38% already. Without knowing, Solana has been going up a plus 38%. Crazy stuff coming in and more crazy stuff soon to kick in. I think that Solana can go to the targets that we mentioned at the start of the video. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Thank you. See you soon. Bye.